Next phase of trials is now underway on a controversial therapy to treat brain tumors. Medical reporter Liz Bonus joins us now to share how it's giving new hope in our Living Longer report. Liz. Hey guys, good afternoon. The type of cancer that we are talking about today is called glioblastoma. It is the most aggressive type of cancer in adults and one that grows in the brain. It's tough to treat because it sort of spreads out like a cobweb in the brain. GBM, as it's called, is commonly treated with surgery, chemotherapy, radiation initially. But most often, this leads to survival that, according to researchers at the Cleveland Clinic, is often measured in months and not years. Now, this new experimental therapy helping people beat those odds. This therapy uses a virus to try and treat glioblastoma. It is injected as a live virus into the brain tumor. The virus then spreads within the tumor, and as this video, courtesy of Cleveland Clinic, shows, it then makes the tumor more sensitive to a specific medication. It is a virus humans usually don't get, so there's no immunity to it in the body. Researchers say the virus works as a transport system for a gene needed in the area of the tumor to treat it. A few weeks later then, when the medication is taken, it goes to the tumor and the gene appears to convert it into a toxic chemotherapy that kills the tumor. Now, so far, it appears to be safe. Those in treatment trials, the man you saw in that video, he's one of them. He began in 2014. It appears to have this cancer under control. The next phase of research now that that has started, we'll continue to see how well this new therapy works. You always have to uh, duplicate that. Mm -hmm. So what he has is he still has the cancer, but this is the idea of treating this like high blood pressure, that if you could just continue to keep it where it is and not spread, not have the cobwebs grow. Yeah. And then of course the elephant in the room, could we use it for other cancers like DIPG? Sure. Obviously it's not considered ethical yet to treat or to check kids until right. you know how it works in adults. But keep in mind that what it does is it helps the transport system. So they found the transport system to glioblastoma. They'd have to find the same thing to other types of cancer to get it to work. So it gets it to where it needs to go and then makes the chemotherapy work. It's kind of amazing oh, wow. if you yeah. think about yeah, it. Yeah, I'm just sitting here watching thinking every day practically you have something like this that is a little bit of a breakthrough. And you know, yeah, the people day. that do this, they started tirelessly 10 years ago oh and all God. those walks and the God. people, yes. That's why it takes so much money for research. Yes, yes, they do. And they never give up. They start with that little tiny thing. Yeah. Say, we found the system, now we find how to yeah. work it. And it's never this big thing. It's little steps yeah. of people that never give up hope. And you find them.